Okay. Okay. Okay, my friends. Welcome, 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 welcome to this match of League of Legends against Katarina. There she is. She's the well-known um, roamer. Damn, I used this way too early. She's not going to let me do that. She's not going to let me do that. So, wasted a little bit of mana. Maybe not. Maybe it's going to, you know, regen in time. Okay. Uh, welcome to the last non-season 14 game. Because I feel like I won't upload any more of these. <clears throat> you know, the map is still the... Still the... Oh. The old one. For the last time. Oh damn, without ping I feel like I'm... I feel like I'm moving too fast. That's funny. I've gotten so used to playing with a big ping. Yeah. Um, yeah, she said Pokrick. I don't know. Uh, maybe she recognizes me. Maybe she doesn't. You know, it's not that I don't respond out of some kind of... Um, arrogance or something i just don't have a good answer to that <laughs> you know oh ah, yorick predict i just don't have a good answer for that and that's it it's about all uh hide on bush killed lucky's gabalas is that lithuanian lucky's gabalas <laughs> Ah, she tried. Nope. As Jordan Peele said, nope. By the way, I saw the movie called Poor Things. And no, if you're wondering, I'm not an asshole. Because usually... Okay, what is going on? I have to prevent her from joining anything anymore. Oh, damn. Yeah, good use of ghost. Best use of ghost you've seen, right? Maybe I can slap her, you know, you know just salvage this um, use. No. Itty would it I saw the movie Poor Things and yes, uh, no. If you're wondering, I'm not an asshole. Because usually these types of art house movies are being watched by people who just think they're better than everyone else and yes I recognize that that might not be a hundred percent true but in every joke there's a tiny bit of joke as I like to say which is obviously a play on the saying that every joke contains a grain of truth and it kind of refers reverses it which I really like because I think that Every joke, the mo for the most part, is the truth. And the joke part is... Oh, what are you doing? You're gonna lose this. Oh, maybe not. I don't know. Oh, if she has Ignite... Okay, she doesn't. This is living fast. She might kill me, so I... I don't know. Oh, almost. Damn, I don't like this. I don't like this at all. I don't know what's her strength, you know. What can he? What's her damage output? Oh, if I can farm this, then I'm safe. Yeah. Okay. Now I can go back. So yeah, I'm a big believer in in the saying that you know, truth is comedy. So, there is a grain of, you know, joke in it, in saying that uh, people who watch art house movies, let's just say it's hard to talk to them, you know, 
Let's be a little more sympathetic. Okay. Oh. Oh. There it is. There it is. And there it is. Okay. One big difference uh, of playing on the live server instead of the PBE, I would have, uh, you know, bought the Profane Hydra, but now, you know, I have to choose something else, and that will be the Collector. I know it's not a replacement, but itty would itty. And you know, I was watching this. Um, the ticket was kind of special uh, for them for the movie, and um, it doesn't come out until you know something like 16th or 19th or something. And um, okay. Oh. Uh, so I was able to see it early, you know. And the guy came out before the movie, which never happens, and he gave a little bit of a speech, and... Ah, uh, she did. No, she's not dead. But she used ult, and she lost more health, so... Who's the big dad? I feel like Yorick is the big dad. Big dad voodoo. Okay. And the guy gave a little bit of a speech. Oh, no, 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 the maiden could die now. I have to take one shot for her. Oh, the wall did it. Whew. Oh. It's, it's, it's kind of hard to, you know, manage all this. You have to be really good with your maiden control. Okay. Let me just go back and refill my maiden's health. And the guy came out of the before the movie and gave a little speech and he was very happy that the theater was packed for such a art movie. He kept calling it art and calling us art enjoyers, which was like, Ugh, come on, man. You know, it's um, it's already bad enough that the movies, uh, it has this vibe. Um, and he kept saying that we are the real art enjoyers and I kept thinking, oh damn, is it really gonna be that boring that he has to say this? But to my surprise, it wasn't boring at all. It was two and a half hours, which was a little long for me. But that had nothing to do with the movie itself. It's just that, come on, sitting for two and a half hours is a little too much for, you know, for anybody. So... Um, and that was kind of good, you know, it had a lot of bad moments and weird moments, um, but it was, you know, it was kind of interesting even, you know, of course the actors, Emma Stone, William Defoe, you know, obviously carrying everything, but, um, you know, we got to see Emma Stone's uh, let's see, as the old one would say, um, <laughs> which was, you know, which was a part of the movie. Uh, my friend said that she had never been in a role where she shows herself in that way. So, I guess that was exciting for the um, all of the Emma Stone's fans. It's I'm not. She's a, she's a good actress, actually. You know. Uh, I'm not a... I wasn't a huge fan of her before the movie. Um, oh. Is he gonna jump away? Oh. Um, but it was nice to see a person who captures your attention so much just with her basically face that it's kind of interesting to sit through the movie even if at some point you uh, some points you think ah oh, it's a little repetitive a little bit boring oh. uh, a little bit to the right the wall okay why is Alice what is the cow doing there I don't know okay So yeah, Emma Stone, he has, she has um, a little bit of that 
actress star quality where you you watch her face and it's interesting a little similar to Joaquin Phoenix you know a little bit similar to that oh to that guy I remember having the same feeling when I was watching the Joker even though Joker I liked it a lot more um, but this had a little bit of the same, you know, thing. Oh, what are you doing? I think she understands that she has to use it. Otherwise, I'm just gonna push her all the time. I think she, she she's smarter than you think. Oh, <laughs> I didn't predict this. I was lucky this time. Damn, York predict by luck and by the happenstance of the universe. Uh, she must know that... Oh. Okay. So yeah, I would, uh, you know, especially if you're the... the type of a person who thinks that... Um, Damn, can I get this? Um, who likes these weird movies with weird angles, weird colors uh, and stuff. But uh, enjoys the fact that there's the safety of good actors in it. Um, you should definitely see it. It's, it's actually, you know, if they took out a lot of the parts which were kind of repetitive and um, you know just shortened the movie I think it would be much more uh, sitable <laughs> oh don't go there please okay much more sitable through Okay. Okay. But overall, I liked it. It's a weird thing, you know. The plot is something like uh, the girl, woman, jumps off a bridge, dies. Crazy scientist, Frankenstein type, takes her body. Turns out she was pregnant. And he cuts out the baby, puts his brain into the woman's brain, you know, switches the brains, so she kind of becomes an infant, uh, if you go by the brain. And she learns everything, uh, you know, from, from zero. From zero to hero. Can I take this? No, no, no. Why is she drinking the potion as she's coming? What was that? Was she drinking a potion or what? Because I saw the green thing on her. Okay, I don't know what that is. Oh, is she going to use her ult again? <laughs> what you doing? You're not going to win this. You might even die now. I actually wasn't comfortable going in, so I'm glad she flashed. I wouldn't have dived. But she got scared of the ghost. One more reason why ghost is better than flash, because, uh, you know, lower cooldown. Trade one for one. It's fine. Oh, <laughs> oh she dead. That's kind of beautiful. She died from a gank, because she probably had more confidence just because this guy came out. Okay. Can you fight this, or is Echo just going to die? Okay. I think for my next item I'm gonna buy the Hydra one one last time. Actually I do wanna get this, yeah. I usually avoid going to it without the family. Oh damn, uh, you know what happened? His pathing changed because of my wall and and he didn't go into Echo's you know, sphere thing. Oh no, we can't do this. Or can we? Uh, 
Okay, we probably can. Probably can. Can I please get it? Oh, doesn't give a F about me. Okay. That doesn't give a F about, you know, our feelings. Oh, he mad. Let me just uh, stay here for a second. Let's just say I was a little bit confused uh, from his pings. I was stunned, so that's why I stood there for a moment. Okay. So this guy is farming mid. It basically means I have to go back. You know what it means? I have to quickly, very quickly go to the bottom. Which I think I can do. I can manage to do. Oh no, this guy... What are they doing? Why are they trying to prevent me from farming? Okay, I wonder what's gonna happen there. Oh, she dead immediately. Okay. Echo Namista. I like it. I like that name. Thank you for that. And William Defoe was very funny in it. You know, he had some great funny lines, you know. And Emma Stone achieved some kind of a humor that I've never seen. There was, um, it's, it's definitely worth seeing, you know. If you're afraid of it being like the art house movie, which it probably is, it's, it's way better than, you know, than most uh, that type of art house movies because it's way better, you know. I was, I was afraid that I'm gonna be, you know, bored. Oh damn, I interrupted that. Pokrit predict like a boss like a boss oh. Do I need to use ghost here? I think I do. I really don't want to fight this. Please don't stop it um, But this was actually not a prediction again. It was a kind of a universe prediction meaning that uh, oh doing can she finally do it or not no the answer is no it was also kind of a universe prediction meaning that it was a coincidence oh no what the f uh, you know that's you know eighty what it i have to painfully say painfully Damn, look at this wording here. So beautiful. Is this word for TP? Maybe. Who knows? Okay, let me buy this. And... Then I'll be fine. So yeah, if you are scared that there's going to be a situation where you walk into the movie and you watch it and it's black and white, you know, and there's all kinds of Gabe-like things going on. Um, Gabe-like things going on, you know, when Gabe was showing his art in the office. And then when you say that, ah, I don't like this, you know, it's boring, it's unnecessarily gruesome. Um... When you say that, um, you're scared, you're worried that someone's going to say, Oh, you just don't get it, man. You're not a real artist. And um, that shouldn't happen because it was, you know, it wasn't that boring. It was quite entertaining, actually. Oh. Oh. Slap turn. Yorick bait. Yorick predict. Okay. Yorick predict, Yorick bait. That's that's the story of this match, I would say. Okay. Do I even take the Gromp or do I just straight go straight for the tower? Yeah, I take the Gromp. 
this mis misfortune could, um, you know, I'm just not gonna do anything on that tower with her being there. Okay. Can we get this? I think we should. Yeah, yeah, we can. Oh! What's the problem? Is there someone there? Wife, check it. Damn, Yorick is a. Kind of like a bad husband, husband, right? Oh, he's using ghost even. Come on, man, let me just wall you in there real quick. I don't know what this guy is doing, but I guess you know he had. Oh, okay. Yorick, not predict. Kind of well played, but yeah. Come on, man. I'm not gonna go into four people hoping that we're gonna kill all of them. <laughs> Come on, man. Do you think he's right? I think he's kind of right in being, you know, hopeful, but come on. When I ask usually the question, is he right? I wanna know, do you think it was a higher chance to kill all of them or higher chance for us to just die? Like he did. And I think it was way higher chance that we're both just going to die. Yeah. And he mad. You know. Itty what itty. Itty what itty. Can I get this guy? I haven't bought it, you know, for a long time. Don't think I'm going to buy it anymore. So let's do it for the one, one last time. Okay. Can we even win this? Or is it gonna turn bad for us? Okay. It was extra tilting for our top laner because he's the one who died, but the ghouls took the kill from him. So <laughs> you can kind of you can kind of get his foot frustration he's still wrong for being mad no he's not wrong for being mad he's wrong for cultivating the madness you know because don't get me wrong my friends it's good to be mad it's nice to be mad but it's not good to think that you have to cultivate the madness and um, that you are in I don't know some in some ways kind of justified in being mad no, you are justified, but I, I, I don't know how to explain this. Um, okay, can I slap this? I'll just soak the gold a little bit, yes. I don't want to say it's um, bad to justify, because, you know, justifying, it's exactly that. You say why that is, and it's fine, you know, because bad feelings are they're good <laughs> as counterintuitive as that sounds okay what's not good is when you kind of um you know you wallow in them no that is not good that is cause for concern let's not do this please just take what we can okay Oh, Mr. Zed, getting blocked by that wall. Like I'll go in and, you know, he has an escape. I get it, I get it. Or does he even have an escape? Right now I'm not even sure. Oh. Am I living too fast here? I might. Okay. Oh, I miss the fact that you triggered this with E. Yeah? Not gonna happen anymore. Not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Oh. Can I catch him, by the way, I wonder? If he's gonna be recalling in some bush where he shouldn't, I will catch him. Let's see, maybe he's recalling in this bush. Okay, let's, let's say that he isn't. No, he 
was that? I wonder if he recalled. I don't know. Okay. Oh, looks like we're gonna win. It's very nice. Do I have to be scared? In PBE, this indicator doesn't work. So it doesn't mean that the crab is spawning. But on live, it, uh, it does. So. Okay. Ta -da. Our echo is a beast. I don't usually use a description like that, but I have to give him some props, you know. Okay. Ta can't catch him probably don't need no need to you know go there I'm level 17 you know the cow is level 8 11 by the way this guy on PBE um, I had a moment where he had three items like the big mage items I was level 17 and he was level 13 and he killed me from I believe 85% or something and that was just a moment, you know, a moment to remember. Where are they? I have to catch this guy now. Oh, slapped. Okay. Yeah, I'm really gonna miss the E trigger on the cleave. Okay. And I was kind of actually excited when that happened to me, when the cow killed me on PBE. Because, um, it's... I like it, you know? If he chooses to be a glass cannon, in his case, he's not even a glass cannon. Because he has R, right? But I like it. So yeah, thanks for watching this. And I will see you in the next one.